legends. Today is a great day and I thought it would be cool to invite you up to my studio and show you around. Let's go in. So this, this is my very first studio. I just got the keys to my very first studio space and as you can hear, it's still empty. It was a big step to move out of my bedroom and sign a lease in August 2019. But I'm here now and it's exciting. So this is a table where I create. So this desk is dedicated to drawing alone. I like to record everything that I draw and for that I use the podcast microphone holder to hold up my iPhone mount and this will give me a nice over the shoulder look on whatever I design on here. I either use my iPad or some paper and I get all my most used tools right here next to me in this trolley. So it's an Ikea trolley, super easy to set up got three different layers on the top layer i got a divider with my favorite pencils and tools that i use most of the time for example i'll use a pencil and a marker and then i simply go in the time lapse mode of the iphone press record and this allows me to easily record without spending too much time setting up the shot So right here we have my working desk. At this desk, I only work on the computer and it's also a standing desk, which is different from any other of my desks because I like to change positions as I work. So right now you probably are wondering why I have two different desks to work on. Well, the idea comes from a book that I read. It's called Atomic Habits by James Clear. And he says that your body will react differently to whatever object or place you are in. Meaning that if I will sit down at this desk, my brain will go into task mode, into editing, into, into administrative work. And whenever I sit at the other desk, then I will immediately start and be creative. This is my spare desk and usually used by my assistant Judith. And this is Chloe. Our only house plant. We're trying to keep her alive. And this, this is our chill area. Sometimes it's just nice to sit back, relax, and to think of different ideas. It's great to read, to draw, or to exercise. What was important to me is that it's also a guest tank. You might remember the wall behind me from a different video, How to Paint a Mural, where we try to make the best use of all of our walls. Now probably the only interesting thing in our kitchen is our coffee machine. And we got a grinder with only decaf coffee beans. Now you probably are asking why decaf, like real artists drink real coffee. Now, of course, decaf is real coffee. It's just the caffeine that's taken away, which is really great for our hands. And I've started to feel that in my emotions and just feeling more anxious when I drink more coffee. So switching to decaf at the office was probably the best choice we could have made. Speaking of coffee, I feel like I could really use one more now. Ah, oh, coffee is always a great idea. It's also great to have a large table to do a lot of work that just demands a lot of space. For example, signing a lot of books or to package those books up and to send them away. And this is our chalk wall. It used to be a white wall, but we painted black using a chalk wall paint. I usually only draw on the left side of the wall. 
That's due to Instagram's format, 4x5, which is a portrait mode, so only a small section of the wall is being used here. But I decided to paint the whole wall black just because the finish will be nicer and we can still use the other side of the wall for brainstorming and creative projects. To record my time lapse for the chalk wall, I still use the same setup as I would at my desk. Just turn around the tripod So here we have all our storage space for tech and gear, and on the other side for pens and paper. In these drawers we have our archives of papers and sketches and final artworks, for example. And finally our cutting board at the top. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the studio tour and let me know in the comments below if there's anything else you want me to focus in on. And Wait, I feel like I forgot something. What was that? Um, oh, I forgot the dance floor. I'ma wake up and dance. Join them seven seas board. Working on any more dog. All right, see you in the next video.